What's going down, Miles Kai fans? Welcome back, York, Pennsylvania. But I'm Ching, grocery outlet central. I am at Bones and Shells, and I've got Dan Killer Kennedy behind the camera once again. A long time ago, about a year ago, we did a prime rib challenge. I doubled that beastly boy up, and that was awesome. But so I talked to the owner, and I was like, hey, can we come back and possibly do something? They're putting together a burger challenge for both Dan and I and it's going to be all of their burgers all stacked over seven pounds of beef all of their varieties including a patty melt and all the fun plethora that word means a patty lot melt. patty, patty melts melt. i love patty melts it melts between the patty and the bun there's no bun that's bread but anyway over seven pounds of beef and i'm gonna assume it's probably about 10 pounds at least of food um i don't think we even set a time limit on the bad boy so we're gonna see what's going on with this uh we're gonna do it medium rare rare and Totally excited because I love burgers and I love stacks. Let's do this. Let's get some burger on. Where's the beef? Alright guys, Bones and Shell brought this spread. Holy crud, it is a beastly table here. Beast. Um, two of each on each plate, so he gets one, I get one. Um, yeah, this is exciting, I love burgers. Oh. <laughs> Let's get into this, we'll kind of go through it as we go, so. Yeah. yeah. What do you want to start with? There you go. Ah, I'll start, we want to start over there, I'll start over there, I'm going to swap. Yeah, sure. Yeah, so this one here just looks like a... Uh, this is coleslaw and cheese. <laughs> this one here is just a cheese burger. A Swiss burger? It's got coleslaw on it. I know they're really good. Is that coleslaw on it? Uh huh. Hi, if you eat one, I'll eat one of them if you want to play. Yep. Uh, it's a perfectly cooked burger. No, it's like pot roast or something on here too. Pot roast? You know why they call it rump roast, don't you? Because nobody needs it if they call it a cow's ass. <laughs> Yeah, it's fire. That's kind of pretty big. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's good. You got a switch of roots. Yeah. It is a Swiss burger. That's just Swiss cheese. That's Swiss cheese. This one has pot roast on it, and uh, it's like some sort of coleslaw cheese. Mm. It's good. That's good. That's real good. Wow. A lot of leaking. The challenge is actually bigger than the honest thing because these are not small burgers. The thumbnail is going to be crazy though. I got to come up with something clever huh? Burgers in my bag of Gehenna. Where's the beef challenge? Where's the beef? <laughs> Which one are you doing next? Mm -hmm. I gotta uh, pick up my scrapling. Oh. 
안 돼, 안 돼. I'm going for the one with the uh, barbecue sauce, the bacon, and the onion straws, and the cheese. I'm going for this plain burger. <laughs> Little cat's fun. Oh. Cat's This is called the ultimate sampler. <laughs> really hungry. What? That's the sampler? Yep. Yeah, sample of everything they have. You can eat it all, it's free. I don't think so. How are we yeah. doing? Okay, right. You guys want silverware for your Mac burger when you get there? Probably, yeah. That one might be a little raw. Yeah, that was a little messy. That was a little raw. <laughs> well, I told it between rare and mid-rare. I found me. You're good? There was another one that was yeah. a little bit redder than that one. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> That's a little red for my leg. Yeah, of course I got to die soon, I'll keep the calories up. That was good. Put your lid on. What is this? Bacon and something else. Bacon and onion straws. Onion straws. That's the western. Western. Bar. Got barbecue on there. Plain Jane. Plain Jane. I put a uh, little shot of cat on it. Yeah. You got the one that was down on the plate, I got the one that was raw. <laughs> Okay. Mm -hmm. Chips okay, or do you want fries? 
There's only five left cheese. <laughs> five? Six fries. Seven fries. Oh, seven's very loud. This one's a beef. Thank you. Thank you. Not a double. Have we decided or do we need some time? All right, take your time. You try one of the burgers, they're all delicious. <laughs> Not even lying. Except for this blue cheese upon it. Nothing.
Oh, wow. It is. It's a lot of food. <laughs> And we don't do, we don't cheese it out with our burgers. There are eight ounce burgers, so each patty you're eating is an eight ounce patty. Every two patties you're eating a pound of meat. <laughs> pound of meat. <laughs> and then all your toppings, the rolls, the cheese, the barbecue, the mashed potatoes, everything else. I'm figuring you guys are probably somewhere between 15 to 20 pounds of each. 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 We're awesome. <laughs> Yeah, we heard the owner. 20 pounds. Hey, she cooks it, we just eat it. So you guys out there in YouTube land that are doubting it, you heard the owner. 15 to 20 pounds. Good story? There's a market for that. There's people that sell sweaty tops. Make a fortune. The like longer you wear them, the more she charges. <laughs> I never showed you that. That lady that made like a million dollars a year selling her sweaty one sock. <laughs> Right. He wears them, puts them straight in her vacuum bag, and you vacuum it your arm so they arrive fresh and wet. I'm like, what the hell is wrong with people? Do we need anything else? That's actually a thing. Hmm? That's actually a thing. I know. Oh. Best part about this, single china, any type of seafood. Uh -huh. We're totally ruined it for me. Good lord. What is this called? That is the richest mash burger. There you go. It's kind of like a shepherd's pie without the vegetables to go. He had me at no vegetables. <laughs> yeah. I didn't really, I couldn't get behind the uh, fries and the uh
But there's definitely more mass in this than the, the, a single prime rib challenge. Yeah. Has now. Definitely a lot of bread on this. Wow. All the bread. I mean, it's pretty bready. Bready, that's a word, Andrew. You guys in your apple eat. Shit. Apple is orange. Yeah. So is irregardless. <laughs> Which actually is that even surprising me? Yeah. Well, oh, we got that big one. I don't know. This one, like the, I'm, not, I'm not really an open face sandwich kind of person. It, I mean, it tastes good. But, well, it's a little different, I guess. So. Mm. Mushrooms are delicious. I don't really care. Either. Actually, my, one of my favorite appetizers is the fried mushroom. So. Yeah. Yeah. Might be a little bit of biscuit on the burger. Oh. Cheese. Oh. 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 O
too much meat, maybe a. Game in eight pound of meat. It's almost a little too red for me. I'm not really a big fan. This almost looks like the claim station burger. Huh. How's the loaf? It's good. It's not cold now, but we're on back for it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, man. All right. Now that you eat. Burger Challenge. 
Honestly, I'm gonna say my favorite was the coleslaw with the cheese and the bacon. That was actually pretty good. Actually, no one was making it. It was like a pork. Pulled pork. Pulled pork on there. Pulled pork. Roast, roast pork. Yeah, that was delicious. So, every burger was cooked perfectly. Um, Thank you. Dang. Every burger on the menu. Mine is there, there was a, like a seafood or a crab burger or something like that, but I, you know, I can't do that, so. But so I added the patty melt. Um, patty melt. Yeah, absolutely delicious. We had an onion loaf instead of fries and uh, multiple, multiple pounds for this challenge. Insane. Yeah, and, uh, big one. Definitely nothing to bat your eyes at. That was a, from the meat and the toppings and the buns alone, it's, that was huge. So, not too many people can finish that. But if you're ever in New York, check out the phone with the shells. This is not a challenge they offer to everybody, but like I said, they were willing to let me and Dan come in and try something like this. So, definitely appreciate it. Killer food, great people. Um, check out Dan's channel and, uh, We'll be back with a couple of awesome more vid videos and uh, you know, love in the line. Mom and woman versus food.